Uh, the University of Tennessee Lady Vols last night won their eighth uh, NCAA Women's Basketball Championship. They defeated an extraordinarily good Stanford team. Uh, the Tennessee team has very good players. The senator from Illinois, Senator Durbin, and I talked earlier this morning about Candace Parker from Illinois, from his home state. She may very well be the best woman college basketball player already. She's likely to be uh, the first in the draft today of the WNBA. And there were four, this is her last year, she's graduated, she's played three years. And then there were four seniors who played. But even though there were extraordinary players, this win has to be about the coach as well. Uh, Pat Summit has won national championships so often, uh, she's made it look easy. Uh, she won last year as well as this year. Uh, she's won back-to-back -back, uh, championships before. She's won 983 games. Uh, this has been remarkably difficult. In her 34 years, she has dominated women's basketball. She has defined it, but she has also helped it with her spaghetti suppers for visiting players, with her encouraging other coaches, with her patience with the news media. She's shown her willingness to change, uh, visiting with Phil Jackson about what offense to put in, to react to uh, disappointment, playing with her superstar, the young woman from Illinois, Candace Parker, who was playing her last two games with a dislocated shoulder. Uh, but what I like best about the Lady Vols is not their winning streak over the years, it's the example they set. When I was president of the University of Tennessee, which was 15 or so years ago, I would proudly tell everyone that Pat Summit and her teams not only won championships, but their players graduated. It was true then, I believe it's true today, that every single young woman who's played basketball for Pat Summit for four years has graduated from the University of Tennessee. Pat Summit not only requires them to go to class, she says, you go to class and you sit in the front row. I want the professors to know that you are there. Uh, just a glimpse of Coach Summit and her young players on national television is the best possible advertisement for the University of Tennessee that I can imagine.